Talk weather right now, and uh, we had some uh, fog this morning. Has that pretty much lifted? It has, yes. We're now back to clear skies out over Portland. Visibility has improved. Uh, dense fog was out all morning long. We had a dense fog advisory too, but now we have seen that clear. We are much cooler though as we head into our afternoon by about 10 degrees. So here is our 24 hour temperature change. At this point, we're seeing temperatures maybe 8 to 10 degrees cooler in Portland and further north. Uh, then we did yesterday. The coast still sitting in the 50s to 60s, so not as cool uh, or not as much of a change compared to yesterday, but still cool out there. So upper 50s out towards the coast are still socked in by a lot of clouds here. We're seeing those clouds clearing in Portland, still watching out for some hazy conditions and high level smoke around our area too. So it does look a bit hazy outside. September did finish out very warm here. We tied for the third warmest September ever on record. And if it wasn't for those handful of days where we only topped out our highs in the 60s due to thick smoke in uh, mid September there, we likely would have hit the warmest September ever on record. So a lot of heat for our month. And as we head our way into October now, we'll still see a couple days here in the 80s in terms of rainfall. Uh, last month, September was only the third month of our water year that saw above normal rain. So we're still seeing a big drought here across Oregon and we could use some rain. The thing is, there is no rain in the forecast for at least the next seven to eight days. Hopefully that changes, but the next chance I see some rain may be next weekend. So Again, a good while of dry weather here. This dry stretch continues. Take a look from our coin tower cameras looking towards the northeast here. You can see a bit of haze out. Still some high level clouds too. Can't really see any views of Mount St. Helens or uh, Mount Hood very well, at least from our cameras here. Our day planner will see a warm up here moving into the afternoon. Highs again still in the low 80s and we'll see a very hazy finish to this evening time. Also, as we see that sun setting, there is a full moon tonight, so take a peek outside. I think we'll see clear views here as we move forward. So it's actually full today at 2 p.m., but won't be able to see it well uh, in the daylight. So tonight, great views of the moon may even see a bit of a reddish hue. It's the harvest moon tonight. Again, red due to some haze and smoke out there. So again, should see some beautiful uh, views of that moon. Also, October 1st here, the first full moon this month. There's a second one, which makes it a blue hunter's moon, and it's on Halloween. So we have a special month here with two full moons on the way. Here's our satellite and radar. You can see that fog lifting here, but still some smoke around. Clouds also socking in the coast. So we are going to see some haze to move forward. Air quality taking a hit further south. Medford, uh, unhealthy air in the valley. We are mainly in a moderate category. It's likely we'll stay that way. So smoke still in place. It'll start to transport towards the east sides as we move forward this weekend. Watch out for haze in central and eastern Oregon. Portland will still see some haze at least through tomorrow, but stronger west winds will help to uh, push that haze out. In terms of our weather pattern, this ridge just sits as we move forward. So again, not tracking any rain here as we head our way into the weekend and beyond. Today, a high of 83 degrees in the valley, now towards the coast, the upper 60s. So, quick look at our seven day forecast here. We'll stay in the 80s at least through tomorrow, cooler by the weekend, back in the low 70s. Back to you guys. Thank you very much.